L is for the way you live. L O is for the only one I see. V is very, very extraordinary. E is even more than any. One that you do and love is all I have to Oh, yes, yes, yes. Look at it. Yeah. Hello, I'm Veronica. And I'm Reese. Welcome to the fifth edition of Ryler on Air to the 2016 Bill season. There are 10 days left until bag day. Thankfully, we have President's Day off, so we have a full work day. Thanks, Obama. This week, all the subteams have been perfecting their parts of the robot. The drivetrain subteam is nearly finished. They've been working very hard for the past week to make sure they perfect it. The media team is finished with the media submission and has submitted the final copy. On Thursday, we will have a robot demo at Center Grove Elementary School's science fair. The scouting subteam has finalized the stable version of our scouting app. You can see our app at any competition. This week, the subteams all assembled the pieces of the robot and created a fully working and drivable robot. And now, a quick questionnaire at the IC. Why did you join Red Alert? Well, I was new to the school and my friend told me to join and I came just to kind of check it out and it was really fun and I loved it. How do you think the build season is going so far? I feel like it's going a lot better than last year since we actually spent more time designing so our designs are more thorough. However, now that it's towards the end of the build season, I feel like time is getting more crunched, but we'll get it done and we'll have a good year. If you could have any animal as a pet, what would it be and why? Um, I would have a pterodactyl because I'd want people wondering how in the world I managed to get a pterodactyl. What's your favorite thing about competitions? Uh, my favorite thing about competitions is going through the pit. What is your favorite animal and why? My favorite animal is a panda because um, they're small, cute, and they love to roll around in snow. How do you like the new workspace? I like it. I think it enables our team to work a lot more effectively by having the build area and the practice field in the same building. What's the coolest thing you've learned this season? Uh, how to program in Java, HTML, PHP. Next, we have a captain's corner with the controls captain, Ben. Hi, I'm Sarah, and I'm here with Ben, the controls subteam captain. So Ben, can you tell us a little bit about what controls does? As control captain, as controls captain, it is my responsibility to make sure that uh, all of our electronics are safely on the robot and so that they don't get damaged and we can effectively control the robot how the other subsystems want us to control the robot. Alright, what are some ways you're doing that this year? Uh, we've prepared an ECU, or we, it's short for Electronics Containment Unit, to make sure all of our hardware is in one very accessible place that is safe from the outer areas of the robot so that other robots don't potentially damage it. Is the smaller robot this year providing a challenge for your subteam? Yes, our biggest challenge this year is actually our space management. Uh, because this robot is smaller than other years, that makes, us, that makes it harder for us to manage the space and manage all the cables, and cables can get below the robot and that can be a problem. So the small amount of space can, is really proving to be a very, very difficult challenge for us. Right. That's something all teams have to deal with, I'm sure. So that's your biggest challenge, but what's something you're really excited for this year? I'm really excited for our vision tracking. This is the first year we have attempted to do a vision tracking and fire uh, during autonomous. I'm thinking it's going to go well. We have a lot of work uh, to do on it, but I think it's going to be a success in the end. All right. Well, thank you for talking to, to us today, Ben. It sounds like you have a lot of work to do, so we'll let you get back to mm -hmm. it. Thank you. Thanks for that update, Control Sub Team. We appreciate all your hard work this build season. Congratulations to this week's student of the week, Maddie, and the mentor of the week, Mr. Coolum. Hey Reese, what did the man say to his dead robot? What? Rust in peace. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you all for watching Alert on Air this week. See you all next week. Bye. Bye. Recording in five. <laughs> Are you okay? Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm sorry.
Okay. Laugh at that. Okay. Okay. Recording in five. Congratulations to this week's student of the week, Maddie, and this week's mentor of the week, Mr. Kulum. <laughs> Zoomed in on you. <laughs> Gross. Okay, guys. That's a that blooper. 